How to use looks on Shopify in 2023, a step-by-step -step tutorial. So hi guys, the first thing that we're going to do is to simply open our browser and log into our Shopify account. Now here in our search bar, click on apps and go to recommended apps after that. Now here below, we can see a link in our Shopify app store. Click on the link and basically it will route us to a separate page. Now here in another search bar, click on looks. So, when you type in looks, that's spelled as L-O-O-X. Now let's wait for the page to load. And there you have it. We can see looks, product reviews, and photos. Now let's click on this. Basically, Looks is a popular Shopify app that allows you to collect and display customer reviews with photos on your online store, helping you build trust and increase conversions. Alright, and then here below we can actually see what Looks does. So basically, it collects product reviews with photos and videos from your customers and it displays reviews as well in beautiful widgets to build trust with the visitors all right now here under pricing as you can see there are three different pricing plans so for beginner we have $9.99 cents a month for growth we have 34 dollars and 99 cents a month and for unlimited we have 299 dollars and 99 cents a month now let's go back and let's open our looks app now when you open your looks application basically the first thing that will uh, route you would be your dashboard so here you can see a welcome page from looks and in the dashboard you can see referral performance upsell performance review request sent and the likes here you could also change your plan if you do want to upgrade your plan then you can simply select on this one and click on upgrade all right and there you could also get more reviews by ticking on those buttons right there now let's go to our next section our settings section so in our settings section here we can actually manage new reviews so here you can actually choose how many stars you would like to publish on your Shopify app store basically or in your Shopify store all right now here for review notifications you can actually disable that one too just click on the drop down you also have a request timing right here so you just need to choose on the days to set the timing of the first review request email now here for a discount for photo or video reviews you will just simply select or input the type of discount. So here in the drop down, we have no discount, percentage, and fixed. Now for the amount, you can actually choose the amount that you would like to have. For example, let's have fixed and then let's have 20 right here. Now for our on-site and review requests, let's leave it as is. For video reviews, you need to upgrade to the growth plan in order to make use of that one. For emails, you can actually request emails, review request reminders, photo or video reminder, discount for photo video reminder, and the likes. Now let's click on our review form. Basically, this is how our review form looks like. You can actually change the theme color and the corner radius. Now here in the text section, you could also input your rating page title, rating page title with no item for 1 star, 5 star, and the likes. 
just simply hover around and input all the details that you want to put in the form now here we could also make custom questions right here so add your own questions on the growth plan so this is not available in our beginner plan basically now here you could also set up a referral offer so we have the two-sided incentive and the one-sided incentive right here incentive incentivize customers to share a discount with their friends and families and for one-sided let the customer share a discount with their family and friends now let's click on the widgets icon right here so here you can see on-site under on-site you could also change the color of the button as well you could also set the primary colors and the likes you just need to hover around the page you could also do this in the post purchase and post review as well now under preferences we can actually opt to choose fraud protection so to prevent misuse of your referral program by turning on fraud protection social media image choose the image that will be used for referral links and emails now let's go to our next section which is orders so under orders you can actually see the orders basically that has arrived from your shopify store All right and you could also actually send a manual review request email just click on the link so when you click on the link basically you will see all these contact details email address first name last name and email subject now under reviews as you can see we do not have any reviews yet because um, nobody has purchased from our shopify store yet and this is our first time having looks but if you do have a csv file you can actually export all your reviews in there now another way of importing reviews is here one click import from aliexpress import from supported apps and import from a spreadsheet so you just need to follow all these instructions that are provided by looks and lastly we have our help section right here so basically in the help section this is where you can actually look for support or ask questions there are articles that um, looks will provide to you when you do have any questions about a specific thing or when you're having troubles hovering around looks basically we cannot route our help page just yet for now so here in the settings um if we have missed out the preferences section as well so here in preferences you can have localization so from english to your own language you can choose that one under integrations as well you can actually link your um looks to other platforms like google twitter and whatnot and that's about it for today's video thank you so much for watching hope you